Have you ever downloaded a file from the internet and you've saved an image on Google Images and you're eagerly awaiting to download either a JPEG or a PNG file and what you've done instead is downloaded a WebP. So this is basically an image format which is used online quite a lot. It's quite efficient, but it's not really usable in other applications. So for example, if I want to be able to edit this or add it to an image editing application or upload it to websites, however, WebP formats are basically incompatible for a lot of applications. For example, if I want to upload it to Instagram, Instagram, then this is not going to work correctly. So basically what you need to do is convert it. So today what I'm going to do is to show you how to convert WebP files on a Mac into something that's usable, for example, PNG or JPEG. And this is going to show you the full simple process. So we've downloaded a WebP file from the internet and I've got it here up in my finder. So let's say I've got this image here. So what I want to do is to double click on this and it's going to open up in preview by default. So preview is basically the Mac's default image handler. You can also control click and open with preview and it's gonna come up with this window. And basically what you wanna do is export this as a different file type. So here, for example, we're gonna to go to file and then we're gonna to go to export and then we're gonna export this as a different file. So I'm gonna put this in my downloads folder. We're gonna call this one logo. And the important thing is that we change the file format here. So we have other options that we can choose. We can choose JPEG, JPEG 2000 or PNG, for example. And what I'm going to do is to keep the alpha. So I want the transparent file and this transparency is going to persist. So I'm going to press save now. And then here we've got logo M3 and this is now a PNG file. So if I control click and get info, this is showing PNG image. So basically it means that if I want to use this for an Instagram post, for example, I can drag and drop this PNG file and this is going to be working correctly. So now that's how you basically convert a WebP file into PNG or JPEG on a Mac. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.